Well, friends, we gather in the presence of God to give thanks for the gift of marriage and to witness the joining together of Keaton and Megan. Megan, we are soulmates. I have no doubt about that. You're the most perfect blend of amazing qualities. You're loving, beautiful, smart, funny, responsible, talented, and beautiful, again. <laughs> Keaton, I'm so happy that our hearts found their way to one another. I don't know if I've ever told you this, but your voice was the first thing about you that I fell in love with. And everything I love about your voice is attributable to who you are as a person. It's confident, calm, refreshing, and always has a tone of reassurance. You always communicate to me with kindness and compassion, and listening to you is a constant comfort to me. Ah! <laughs> Hi, girl. Ah. Mwah. Mwah. Oh my gosh, you look so beautiful. Oh my God, <laughs> baby, you're stunning. Oh, you look beautiful. Oh my God. I remember our first official date. We walked from my apartment to downtown Sturgis at the Knuckle. Um, we had supper, we danced, and it just it felt very natural, and, and it just felt like we needed to be together. Megan, I knew by the way we held hands and by the way we looked at each other, I knew you were special. Today, I vow to always show you my dedication to our relationship and to never make you guess just how much I love and care about you. I will always show you how much I appreciate you in all that you do for us. I vow to always ask before I throw away leftovers in case you wanted to eat them. <laughs> I vow to be the woman that you deserve and the mother that our children deserve. Megan, you are the perfect mother to our children, Josie and Veda. I have countless moments and examples of your unconditional love for them. They're so lucky and blessed to have you as their mother. Keaton and Megan. So as these four containers of sand are poured into this bottle, they now blend just as you do to become one. I remember going to the Luke Combs concert with you in Sioux Falls. It seemed like Luke Combs was singing, you know, he was right there and it seemed like he was singing to me and you, Megan. Um, the song Better Together by him was, you know, holds a special spot in both of our hearts. And I can't help but think that him singing it that night was meant a little bit for you and I. And I want to share these lyrics um, because they hit home with me and I know they hit home with you. And I'll share these with, with everyone today. Are you going to sing it? <laughs> you requested it. <laughs> Your license in my wallet. When we go out downtown, your lipstick stained every coffee cup that I got in this house. The way I say it, the way you say it, I love you too, is like laying on an old tin roof. And your hand fits right into mine like a needle in a groove. Some things just go better together and probably always will. Like a cup of coffee and a sunrise, Sunday drives and time to kill. What's the point of this old guitar if it ain't got no strings? Or pouring your heart into a song that you ain't gonna sing. <laughs> I vow to always date you and always give you the romance that you deserve. I vow to tell you that I love you every day 
and always let you know how special you are to me. And I vow to always support and help parent our children to allow them to grow into the finest human beings they can become. In all my imperfection, I thought I learned my lesson that I'd never be loved by someone like you. I promise to grow with you and support you. And I promise to shoulder challenges and celebrate all of our little wins. And my most important and final vow to you, Keaton, is that I will always love you unconditionally for the rest of my life. Keaton, will you take Megan to be your wife? I will. Megan, will you take Keaton to be your husband? I will. It's my great pleasure to pronounce you husband and wife. so blessed that we found each other and we get to spend the rest of our lives together. I'll be the rock that you can always lean on and I wouldn't want to do life with anyone but you. I love you so much. You are my son.